Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 98, and we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. We had a meeting with Master Kavar, where we've now had the second person tell us that there was more to why we were exiled. And the second time, they've been interrupted and haven't been able to tell us why. I expect at some point somebody will tell me. Please? Please? Do I not deserve an explanation? All right. So uh, we know that, uh, <laughs> that that the the general, the cousin of the queen, is about to start some trouble because he came in here intending to mow us down and uh, avoid the civilians. That's too much paperwork. Yikes. Uh, I'm pretty sure that from here until the shuttle, it's going to be nothing but trouble. So, uh, do, do, do. here we go. Kind of wish we could have that jazzy music in the background as we go. All right. Are you mad? About oh, never mind. I'm about to get mugged over there, so, uh. Let's go ahead and just uh, do. Oh, <laughs> I I ran out of uses of my Mandalorian power shield. Ooh, I've only got three of those left. I need to. No, I don't need to conserve those. I'll get more. I'll find more. Somebody surely can make them, or I'll buy them somewhere, or maybe I'll just get them off of a couple more Mandalorians. <laughs> All right, let's do that, let's do that. And Korea's gonna handle the rest of the buffs because she always does. After she goes charging in though, for some reason. Seriously, get to the buffing lady. That's what you're there for. Oh, did she just bite it? She just bit it. Are you kidding me? Uh. Oh, man. Okay. All right. Looks like, uh... Looks like these troopers are taking a little bit more than I would have expected. Let's just keep a couple of heels queued in there. Yeah, let's throw another one of those in there. <laughs> Saved. Not for long. Alright. What you got? Oh, now you're going to give me the... Alright, fine. Ooh, he's got a Sith mask and there's a strengthening underlay. I think I'm going to need one of those in a minute anyway. Oh, thermal detonator. Hello, beach duck. Could always use a thermal detonator. I hear you can bluff a hut with them. All right. Oh wait, no, that's not till later. <laughs> Frag grenades, always helpful. Security tunnelers. I'm sure I'll get around to needing one of those sooner or later. Oh, and then we got these two unfortunates over here. Hey, speaking of Mandalorian power shields, how convenient. I was needing one of those. And another Rodian Deathblade. Uh, slightly over-marketed, but hey, you know, whatever. By the by, are you still mad about me killing your boss? Nope. Okay, you don't care. Good. As long as we're good. You're not going to try to mug me on my way out. Um... Is that everybody? Oh, no. Looks like there's one more set of remains. One more remains remain. <laughs> we got a computer spike and a... Uh, the cryo band grenade is just going to get turned into parts, but uh, that, that'll be later. We've got stuff to do first. Oh! Hi, guys! Uh, no, let's back up, let's back up. Because uh, I need to get Korea squared away there, alright? Could you, uh, could you kindly heal yourself there? I hear you. Hey, lady. Alright. So, let's go ahead and do speed, and valor, and 
energy resistance and force barrier. Now let's run in there. All right, guys. Get a load of this. No, oh. no, 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 no. I wanted... Is he the only one I can target? Fine. Eat it! <laughs> Get some extra attacks in there. Get down. Man, it's amazing how much easier a fight is when somebody buffs you up, isn't it, Korea? I mean, if only there was somebody in the party whose sole job it was to take care of stuff like that. Ooh, a shield suit and 52 bucks. We'll see if that's actually worth hanging on to soon enough. Eh, concussion grenades and a hyper battle stimulant. Not bad. Let's go ahead and, you know what? Just because I'm paranoid. Just because you're paranoid doesn't mean the game's trying to kill you. Wait. Okay. That's everything here. Let's uh, make our way to the merchant quarter then. Uh. Oh. That crowd just. What? Uh. What's happening in the West Square? It sounded like battle. Command's ordered comm blackout. Do you know what's going on? Uh, nothing to see here. Move along. No. I'm in a hurry. I'll be going. Vaklu's soldiers have been attacking me. Nothing at all, officer. Just minding my own business. Why aren't you shooting at me? All the other soldiers have been. Hey, medic. Yeah, Arcadius had to step away for a little bit, and then, uh, and then we got started. All right. Uh, let's... Vaklu soldiers. What? Why? That makes no sense. Command hasn't issued any alerts. Are you sure it wasn't some of those Beast Rider slags? They've been getting bolder recently. <laughs> no, no, I fought them too. Uh, so not all the soldiers are after me. That is comforting. Eh, it's broad daylight. They were wearing uniforms. Now yeah, let's go with that. You, you must be mistaken. Soldiers <laughs> just don't attack civilians without orders. If it weren't for the comm blackout, I'd check with command. Just head to the safety of the Merchant Square, citizen. We'll send a patrol to investigate as soon as we can contact our HQ. Not um. all the military is after us. <laughs> Still, Vaklu can throw a whole army at us. I think we've outworn our welcome over here. Yeah, we I noticed over that. To the spaceport before General Vaklu invents some charges against us. Then we'd be in real trouble. I told you before, Offworlder, the okay. sky ramp is restricted to military personnel only. Now move along. All right, I'll be going now. Moving along. You know what to do. Wait. Let's. Oh. Oh. So it's going to be like that. Okay. So we got some commoners who are going to assault me in broad daylight, which will bring the troops back on us. Nice. Fine. You know what? If that's what you guys want to do. If that's what you guys want to do. Let's do it. Get him. Oh, now, lady, the time to do that is, you know, in the beginning of battle. That's it. He's just got a lousy computer spike. I demand, oh, 115 credits. Okay, I was going to say, I demand a better class of bad guy. By the way, I almost forgot. Okay. Oh, it's just escape from the merchant quarter. Okay. Uh, you know what? Since we're going to be assaulted, it might be nice to be a higher level. So let's go ahead and level up. Ooh, sneak attack two. The quickening. No. And unarmed specialist six. I'll, I almost wonder if uh, my unarmed attack is 
as good or better than uh, anything else I can do. Alright, let's go. Skills, that's right. We're keeping treat injury up, security up, persuade up, computer use up, and we're going to start moving stealth up as well. Okay. And... Oh, powers. Uh... I mean, I could always do the Beast Confusion. Hmm. And it will cause a hostile beast to fight for you, which could be nice. Seems a little situational, though. Although, Korriban's going to be nothing but little beasties. So that might be worth doing, because I've pretty much hit the top of all the other trees I was working on. So I'll have to figure out what's next anyway. So let, yeah, let's go ahead and, uh, is this one here? Mind trick? Eh. Um, I just, I don't know that I really want to invest a, a power in that. I mean, I'm kind of happy with what I got, but well, I wouldn't mind having the force aura. Force aura might be really nice to go ahead and start working my way down. Since I can't always guarantee that the crew with me will have the uh, skills to to go for it. Attack damage and will. Battle meditation. That might not be a bad one either. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. Let, let's go ahead and start working on the uh, battle meditation. Yeah. Okay. And accept. Sweet. Alright. Just to double check, are there any uh, hidden... Hidden HK parties around here? No? Nothing? Just checking. I mean... People have been hiding out in all the, uh, all the little alleyways and whatnot. No? No. Oh. Is there actually something there? No. Okay. I was getting excited there. I was like, is there something off the map? No, of course not. Alright. We're gonna have to find another source of cheap fuel now that Paragus is... Uh. <laughs> I, uh, I noticed your incident just now. I'm afraid <laughs> I have nothing more to say. Good luck in your travels. Thanks for that. Okay. The diagnostic is doing something strange. Oh no. Target acquired. What the hell does that mean? I think I know exactly what that means. Yep. That's exactly what that means. Alrighty then. Let's uh go destroy droid. Let's get a shield up just in case. And then we'll try a power attack. Come on. Run in there. Come on. You can do it. Focus. Uh. Shoot. Is Korea not up to this? Your visa's been scanned. You're cleared to leave. I'd leave right away. <laughs> Things are going crazy in this court. <laughs> uh, dude, you're being shot at, but, uh... Look, I know you're being shot up, but your visa's cleared, and you probably ought to go ahead and leave. Why, thank you. Come on, man. Zap him! Okay. <laughs> that's... That, that, that's something. All right. Ooh. Droid... Wandranium armor. Sounds fancy. I'll take it. What is up with the controls? Loot the body. Show me the loot. A droid agility upgrade. That could be nice for somebody. That might be nice for HK. <laughs> the soldier just glares at you. Thank you, good sir. 
Oh no. Alright, let, let's see what, uh... Crime rates have been soaring in recent months. Yeah. Even in the Merchant Quarter, the Western Square has seen a dramatic increase in violent crimes. There have been multiple reports of gang warfare on a large scale. Captain Riken of the Onderan military has confirmed over a dozen casualties hmm. today alone. One local resident of the Western Square claims to have heard blaster shots, sword fighting, and even a lightsaber. Um. It's getting so bad that I don't want to leave my house, she said. Well, okay. In local news, a citizen in the Merchant Quarter was mistakenly arrested by Queen Talia's soldiers. The soldiers' report claimed that the speaker was attempting to incite a riot. A preliminary investigation revealed that, although the speaker was intoxicated, he was innocent of all charges. Oh, the is expected to that's, the, that's the guy that we arrest. quieted down. I bet he's working for Vaklu. And, uh, the yeah. The fleet has yet again pushed back estimates for when the beasts will be cleared from our streets. They claim that the blockade continues to hinder their progress. Hmm. Not only has this posed a significant health risk, but there has been a rise of beast attacks in Iziz. Three attacks happened last week. Disturbingly, because there have you been can't... two additional okay. beast attacks today. The frequency of the attacks has been growing. Yeah, there certainly does seem to be a certain quality to the news reports. Alright, uh, any other remains to loot? Nope. Alright, let's, uh, make our way through. I actually expected more the fighting than this. Ahead. I think we should get out of here fast. It's going to be some time before they forget about us here. <laughs> no more trips to Isis for us until the situation changes. A lot. Hmm. Journal entry, XP. Uh, they just barred entry to the merchant quarter. I wonder if there's been another bomb. <laughs> well, there's been something. I again apologize for the Boma attack earlier, Offworlder. How may I help you? Uh, okay. Nothing new to talk about there. I was kind of hoping there would be. And let's talk to this guy real quick, just to be sure. You're back. You still look weak. You buy things, I'll make you strong. Um... Let's see what you got in stock, then. I've already tried everything else. Uh, that's right, the Grey Jedi robe was one that I was looking at. Um, and while the Charisma bonus is nice and Force Regen is nice, a defense bonus of only one is not as good as the Master Robes that uh, all the robe-wearing folks already have. Uh, the Sinigar War Suit is about as good as any other medium armor anybody's got. The powered battle armor is nice, but I don't think my heavy heavy armor folks have... I think my heavy armor folks have better than that already. Uh, the Shire... Oh, oh my. I mean, I like the attack and all, but... Dude. That's... That, that's more... Nope. Just gonna... I might come back later when it's quieter. Um... Uh, Okay. No Riot Blade, no Force Pike. Um, Alright, I'm not seeing anything in here worth it. I mean, maybe some of the uh, upgrades, but I'd have to I'd have to see. The Sith Power Gauntlets might not be a bad idea, but uh, I'll risk I'll risk that I missed out on a deal like that because I'm not sure, and I'd rather. Oh, hey. Speaking of HKs, I think this is the last one I needed. You know what? Let me go ahead and remove her. Add him, and then we'll see if we can get the uh, conversation. But first, it'd be nice to have a fully powered combat droid. Alright, his skills are awareness and repair. And demolitions for some reason. Okay, and I want to improve his flurry, right? Or did I want to do precise shot? I think. 
I think I want to go ahead and up his precise shot. Okay. Uh, didn't I just get some, uh, quadrine? Alright, armor class 10, 7. Eh, nope. I, I like what he's got a whole lot better. Now, I know that unfortunately he's not going to be able to attack them, but I don't think we'll have to worry about it with this go around. Let me go ahead though and speed, valor, battle meditation, and then we'll do this. Diagnostic? For some reason, I cannot fire. <laughs> Obvious statement. This was not anticipated. I am attempting to access my weapon systems, and I cannot. Alarmed embarrassment. <laughs> if this gets back to the other units, we will be decommissioned. Uh. Yeah, let's get a uh, shield on real quick. That's right, and the HK is out. And Duraplating? Might not be that bad. Uh, I guess all those buffs expire during the conversation. Alright. Query, is there someone that you need killed, Master? <laughs> uh No, just some questions. Statement. Ah, more questions. Wonderful. All right, I want to talk to you about the other HK Statement. units. Ah, yes. Them. Very well. <laughs> Them. What did you wish to know? Do you know where these clones Answer. are being created? Master, I do not know. I have tried in vain to find it, but so far <sighs> the location of the factory churning out these copies has eluded me. Statement. I have no idea, Master. Uh, all right. Never mind. I I, I thought that was going to be the last one. You've met three teams of HK fifty. Okay, once on board the Ebon Hawk, he'll be able to figure it out. Uh, I thought because you know he'd be able to. Okay, Master Kavar said he'd contact us later, so we should. We should have the Grandmaster... <laughs> no, not that Grandmaster. We should have Master Guevara later. Um, let's go ahead and put uh, put her back in the party. And let's beat feet to the Mandalorian. Because this should be... You can take the shuttle back to Dixon. Yes, that is exactly what I want to do. Because uh, I think all the other stuff that I would like to do, I need... A there we go. I keep forgetting that every time it does a video, I gotta switch over to a different, different type of capture. I kind of hate that it does this every time you enter and leave a planet. And this music is close enough. I'm wondering if uh, I'm gonna get another copyright thingy. That would be frustrating. That would be very frustrating. All right, loading. Please wait. There we go. We're back. The shuttle is going to stay docked here until further notice. Mm -hmm. I'm not ready to part company yet. It sounds like you have a lot of traveling to do. Mm -hmm. So do I. I'm going with you. The Sith have taken a particular interest in you, and you could use an extra blaster. I've been meaning to leave Duxon to look for other Mandalorian clans anyway. Well then. <laughs> Isn't Clan Ordo enough for you? That sounds altruistic. I didn't know you had it in you. I don't have it in me. It's a matter of self-interest. <laughs> the Sith aren't known for sharing power. 
If the okay. Jedi Order is destroyed for good, it's inevitable that the Sith will dominate the Republic. Yeah. And then my people will be eradicated or enslaved. Helping your cause is a matter of necessity. Mandalorians helped Exar Kun during his war. We know firsthand how we'd fare in the service of their like. Ain't but that that's the truth. For now. We'll have time to talk later. The Ebonhawk is patched up and ready to go. When you're ready to depart, we can ask the guide here to take us back to the ship. Alright. Nice. So. I think that's a good pausing point, because I do want to run around the Mandalorian camp. But I'm already 25 minutes into the episode, so... You know what that means. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died. Then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up live stream archives from some of my other stuff and various and sundry other videos because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, quotes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit. Especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.